Greetings, Keishings. Keishin Prime here with my live reaction of Fairy Tale Chapter 530, Neo Eclipse. Alright. Uh, got another memory in memory number 5. I remember that, but I forget what it was that Dark Guild's name. It's uh, when they got attacked and their guild was destroyed. Uh, okay. Year X777. Capital of Flor. Or Flore. Ah. Crocus. <clears throat> Which is a type of flower. I guess that goes along because Magnolia is the main town. Alright. What is that? Shooting stars? Woo, look! Come visit the Ryuzetsu uh, Land Water Park. Ryuzetsu Land is that water park from the GMG arc and one of the OVAs. I seem to remember that, but I don't know. It's probably been a while. Okay, at the castle there's the princess. I don't know her name. Whoa, look at those stars. <clears throat> So this is when the Dragon Slayers first arrived. But stars should fall down, not rise toward the star to the sky. Look, there's five of them. By the way, has anyone seen his majesty? Where has he gone? Okay, here's another note. The man above appears to be a young uh, Arcadeos. He does look familiar, but that name doesn't ring a bell with me. Okay, there's the Eclipse Gate. It's opening. Uh, what was her name? I swear, I, I suck at names. It's the uh, Lucy's ancestor. What did, was it Luana? No. I don't know. But anyway, you know who I'm talking about. The teacher that taught all the dragon slayers. <clears throat> the gate that has been handed down through generations by our dynasty. To think that someone capable of opening it showed up. Okay, so we got the king. And, uh, there's Lucy's mother. Wait, someone came f from the gate as well? Okay, so Lucy's mom opened it, and then the t <clears throat> her ancestor then comes out of it. Hmm, pardon me, but what year is this? The year's X777. Yes, I did it. I traveled 400 years into the future. <clears throat> uh oh. Wait. Haven't you seen five kids around here? Nah, they haven't seen anybody. When the gate opened, five bright lights came out, flying from within. <clears throat> they were quickly propelled towards the sky. Well. And they went right through the wall. <laughs> so the gate really does connect different times. And you opened it. Thanks for that. So you, who lives in an era of powerful uh, ether, no, ether nano, uh, when the sun and moon intersect, use the twelve keys to open the gate. It was hard for me to believe this, but my family has owned this book since before my grandmother's birth. Oh, Layla Hartfelia. Okay, Layla. Uh, yeah, I am its author. Teacher of the Five Slayers, Anna. Okay, so I just needed to drop the Lou part. Alright, so I was at least close. Yay! Do I get an A for effort? Um, a for stupid memory? Not being completely faulty? Ah, uh, wait a second. I don't get it. What are you talking about? 
King of Floor, uh, Tome E Floor. What does the E stand for then? In order to arrive in the future, I needed someone from the from this era to open the gate. Okay, they got a little diagram 400 years ago, and then there's now, and thus my descendants passed on this message up until I opened it right now. Okay. So you actually came from 400 years ago. That would be correct. Though the book does not signi or does not signify the reasons behind your journey. Why exactly did you come? I'm sorry. I'll explain everything when time is due. I see. Hmm. If Layla opened the Wait, why would it matter? You you came from the past, so it's not going to change the future or anything. It's like, you must never know too much of your future. So just tell them, and I bet you not telling them is what gets her killed, and then Lucy grows up without a mom. I'm calling it right now. I see. Hmm. If Layla Sun opened the gate now... Then that must mean this era is brimming full or brimming with a lot of magic power. Wait, how do you not know that? This was like fifteen years ago. <laughs> how do you people not know that already? I don't really know. This isn't really something that uh, has a set value. I had a different reason. The reason why I chose to open it right now is my daughter Lucy. I don't want her to carry over this responsibility. I want her to be free. Well, that kind of is pointless, isn't it? Because she ended up opening the gate. That's why I decided to end the duty of the Harfelias right this day. Though I guess maybe the re exactly the reason why you open the gate it may be different than hers. Ah, I see. Thank you for everything, Layla. I'm pr proud of my lineage uh, for having followed my mission. You've all done a wonderful job. It was nothing. That said, to think that 400 years later, human culture would thrive so much. I was correct in assuming that Agnologio would have no interest in attacking men. However, was this really the right choice? No, it must. I mustn't waver. I have to believe in the dragon's plan. Now that you have fulfilled your duty, you and your family are free to live together. Y yes. However, I need to get going. I need to find the five children. They are an intricate, or intric, yeah, why can't I say your words? Ah, integral part of the plan. Well then, I'll be off. Take care. By the way, King Toma, uh, make sure to destroy the gate. Oh, right. Yeah, we know how that worked out. <laughs> But before I had realized, she passed away just a few days later. Okay, maybe I was wrong. Here I thought I was right about something, but nope. Sensei. But that power you mentioned before. Right. When I investigated, I found about this power. Shouldn't that say I found out about this power? And this era... This power uh, appeared at that place. It's not an element. It isn't light nor darkness. Well, wouldn't those technically be elements? It's the very nothing itself. The nothing? Okay, we we frickin' pulling a never-ending story. The nothingness. If we see a giant rock, dude, it's like we know that what you've been <laughs> reading, Mashima, or watching, because it is a book and a movie. Uh, 
Such a type of power shouldn't exist in this era, or any era for that matter. After investigating it, I found out what it was. The time lapse. Written as time between time, or space between time. It appears that uh, our crossing of the gate from 400 years ago caused a distortion in the fabric of time itself. Okay, that that sounds about right. It created a hole of sorts in a interval where there is no time nor space. Inside of it, nothing can exist. So that would include even Agnologia. Correct. But that said... Oh, so they're going to throw him into a void, essentially. <laughs> I find it hard to believe that no one found out about this before. That is because I hid it during these years somehow. <clears throat> or somewhere. But we opened the gate again during the Grand Magic's games. Yes, back then the hole itself did react to the gate's opening. Hole? Yes, it's basically a hole in time. Though, truth be told, it isn't bigger than this tangerine. Oh, so it's a black hole, basically. Okay, because black holes don't have to be that big. And they, like that Simpsons episode. <laughs> uh, where Lisa had that little black hole and she, she kept it for some reason. Uh, that was a weird episode. I think that was, that was a treehouse of horror, wasn't it? Now that the dragons are gone, this whole rest is our final hope. Ladies and gentlemen, our plan is simple. Oh, what are you getting into? The fray, each of you. Uh, we'll simply dodge the time lapse and wait for Agnologia. Wait, where has it been? Where is it then? Then we'll bait Agnologia into coming after us, and men, and it just shows a little diagram of, yep, and he just disappears. Why is Wendy shocked about that? Was that actually a slideshow? Yeah, okay, that's not actually on the wall, a little diagram he showed that that's a projection magic. This sounds too easy. Do you really think it'll work? No, I don't think it'll work at all. There's a lot of weird plans going on in manga lately that hinge on too much that can fail. It has to. We have no other choice. Magnolia. You alright, Lucy? Yeah, sort of. You won't be destroying this book any time or anymore, right? Of course I won't. I didn't know it was Natsu's back. It was Natsu's back. Then after all, it should be his heart or whatever. I don't know. Back. What the hell? I have no. Uh, I have an idea. You both. How about we open the book? Happy has a good point there. I wonder what's in it anyway and when that happens to save Natsu you'll need the strength of his will need the strength of his friends shouldn't that be heal yeah a lot of grammar mistakes and whatnot okay Lucy's looking at it Lu listen Lucy I should probably tell them of Zeref's master plan what is it gray Never mind. What? Don't, don't fucking bring it up. <laughs> as long as Natsu is there, I'll, I'm sure Zeref won't be able to accomplish his plan. Let's do this. Okay, so he's thinking that. I don't know what. Seems kind of pointless that he even had to bring that up because she was there. Everybody know, or she knows what's going on, right? 
So why not inform everyone about Natsu's true identity? <sighs> Is that all end? He huffing, I ain't doing that anymore. Ah, you've betrayed my expectations. I really thought you were capable of destroying me. And you give him a big old blast from your hand. What what is going on there? Mm. 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 Excuse me. He got attacked. That does not look like the same magic. I'm going back to look. No, he has kind of like a I don't know. That weird blast kind of thing that he's done before. And that looks like Natsu's fire just really condensed. And it's like a stream. And it's like piercing him, I guess. But not to worry. It'll all be back to how it used to be. If I get Mavis's power, I can return to the, mo to the myself of back then. Okay, Natsu's in pain, so I guess that was his attack. Thanks to Neo Eclipse. What is Neo Eclipse? Has that been brought up? And I'm just stupid. Ah. A gate that leads neither to the past nor the present. It starts everything over. It'll reset time itself. Oh, wait, he isn't talking about the same hull, is he? And just doesn't know I will return back to when I was mortal is that your true goal no one will suffer from what I have done anymore you'd be human again Agnologia would not gain any would not gain any power won't that be quite the happy ending but What's going to happen to us and everyone else? Who knows? Perhaps this world might disappear. <clears throat> Who cares if we suffer in this time because of you? We'll still live on. What is going on with that? I, it's like he's melting or something like going into his body and making the veins. I don't know. Two keys are needed to open Neo Eclipse. The first is Mavis. She's headed here right now. And the second one is the time lapse itself. Humanity's last hope lies in Zeref's hands. Wait, what? <laughs> to be continued in Chapter 531, Pegasus vs. Black Dragon. Okay, I'm confused, and I guess that's the time lapse there. It's like a little black hole, so I guess that's about what I expected. And there will be a, co a colored page. Okay, and there's a clarification page. Uh, from what the chapter describes, the time lapse is a distortion of the fabric of time itself, caused by 400 years caused by the 400 year travel of Anna and the Slayers. It's a black hole, the size of a tangerine, where no time nor space exists, thus further, thus causing anything that falls into it to lose its existence. This would essentially erase Agnologia and is supposedly hidden by Anna somewhere at the place they are headed to. And then Neo Eclipse, on the other hand, Neo Eclipse appears to be a spell or a gate possibly that uh, allows a reset of time in other words something like last ages Yoltir's spell that would bring back Zareph to before he was mortal which is his master plan he told Gray a few chapters ago however by the time it it's explained it seems it would also erase Natsu and everyone else from that time, as it would destroy their era as it is. 
replacing it with the n new one Zeref would create. However, the gate can only be open. The spell can only be activated with two keys. Mm, excuse me. The first is Mavis, Fairy Heart, and the other is the before mentioned time lapse. Again, take this with a bit of a grain of salt. Latter translations might clarify this further. Okay. Hmm. I don't really have much thoughts on it other than why um, Anna couldn't tell Leia about what was going on. You know, I, I think that's kind of stupid. She's from the past, not from the future, so it's not going to affect anything. But, whatever. Bad storytelling when it comes to time travel, I guess is what you could be chalked up to. But, uh, yeah, so no uh, reviews for this one. It was, eh. We got a little idea of what might happen though to be honest I will assume that maybe both of them will come into play Zaref will start using his whole what did he call it uh, Neo Eclipse and then he'll be stopped and then Agnologia will get thrown in there somewhere and then he gets thrown into the time lapse and then things go on as you might expect <clears throat> and uh, I guess that'd be probably about how the series would end and then we'd probably get a who knows how much longer the series will even last at this point right um, yeah so yeah anyway thank you for watching like comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time geeslings roll out